Top 6 Best Camera Phones in 2024 Hello guys, today in this video we are going to help you to find out the best camera phones in market. I made this list based on my personal opinion and I tried to list them based on their quality, durability, customer review and more. If you want to see their price and find out more information about them you can check our links in the description below. And like comment share this video, subscribe our channel. Thank you. Number 6. Google Pixel 8 Pro. The $999 Google Pixel 8 Pro banks on a modestly refreshed design, a trio of capable cameras, and upgraded AI tools to stand out from its flagship peers. Its revised hardware is more pleasant to use, Google's computational photography is as creative as ever, and Tensor G3 powered machine learning smarts allow it to perform photo edits that no other phone can. Add in a crowd-pleasing stock version of Android and a long-term support commitment from Google, and you've got a compelling smartphone that competes with the best on the market. As good as it is, though, the $1,199 Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra holds onto our Editor's Choice Award for flagship Android phones thanks to its breathtaking screen, equally good cameras, productivity software, and S Pen stylus. Google's hardware design is excellent thanks mostly to its simplicity. The Pixel 8 Pro's large camera bar that crosses the rear panel remains the most distinguishing feature. Otherwise, the shiny aluminum frame contrasts nicely with the matte color palette of the glass. Google sent us the Bay model for testing, which is a light blue, the phone also comes in obsidian, black, or porcelain, white. The Bay color stops well short of being bold, which seems on trend for phones these days. Number 5. Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra The Galaxy S23 Ultra, starting at $1,199.99, carries the Galaxy Note torch forward as the lone smartphone in Samsung's lineup to include the S Pen stylus. The company takes the kitchen sink approach with the S23 Ultra, it has pretty much every feature a flagship phone shopper could want, including high-quality hardware, an outstanding display, blistering performance, and top-notch cameras. Its oversized footprint and price give us some pause, but many buyers are likely to look past these compromises for such a capable phone. If you don't need the stylus or the extra cameras, the slightly smaller and more affordable Galaxy S23 Plus, starting at $999.99, might better serve you. But if you want it all, the Galaxy S23 Ultra is our editor's choice winner for high-end Android phones. The S23 Ultra takes many of its design cues from last year's S22 Ultra. The phones are the exact same size at 6.43 by 3.07 by 0.35 inches, HWD, though the S23 Ultra weighs more at 8.25 ounces than the S22 Ultra, 8.07 ounces. The Galaxy S23, 5.76 by 2.79 by 0.3 inches, 5.93 ounces, and Galaxy S23 Plus, 6.21 by 3.0 by 0.3 inches, 6.91 ounces, are much smaller and lighter for comparison. There's simply no denying the S23 Ultra is a massive piece of hardware. Slapping a case on it, which we recommend given the price tag, just adds to its size and weight. The glass and metal sandwich design is common for today's top devices and no company does it better than Samsung. The S23 Ultra features an armor aluminum frame that partially integrates recycled materials. Corning's Gorilla Glass Victus 2 adds front and back protection against drops and scratches. Number 4. Google Pixel 8. The $699 Google Pixel 8 mirrors its larger sibling, the $999 Pixel 8 Pro, in nearly every way. It has the same Tensor G3 processor, the same Android 14 software, and the same long-term support commitment from Google. Its smaller size and some missing features, like a telephoto lens and a thermometer, add up to big savings if those extras don't matter to you. And the Pixel 8's more advanced AI and machine learning powers give it a serious leg up on the budget-minded $499 Pixel 7a. All of these pixels are worth your attention, but the Pixel 8 sits right in the sweet spot, beating out the Moto Edge Plus to earn our Editor's Choice Award for mid-range Android phones. Google has trimmed the screen size of the smaller Pixel 8 and the result is a more compact phone that's just a little bit easier to hold and use. 
It measures 5.9 by 2.8 by 0.4 inches, HWD, and weighs 6.6 .6 ounces, which is more comfortable than the Pixel 7 6.1 by 2.9 by 0.3 inches and 6.9 ounces, as well as the 6.4 by 3.0 by 0.3 inch, 7.5 ounce Pixel 8 Pro. The Pixel 8 has a premium feel with a matte aluminum frame and camera bar punctuated by glossy glass. It comes in three colors, hazel, grayish, obsidian, black, or rose, light pink. These colors pop thanks to the reflective finish, while the muted metal frame offers a pleasing contrast. Google says Corning Gorilla Glass Victus covers the front and back, while the Pixel 8 Pro gets tougher Gorilla Glass Victus 2 on the rear panel. Both Pixel 8 phones are rated IP68, meaning they are dustproof and can withstand being submerged in shallow water for up to 30 minutes. Number 3. Google Pixel 7a. Equal parts sequel and sibling, Google's $499 Pixel 7a offers better cameras, performance, and screen quality than its predecessor, while at the same time bringing just the right mix of fresh features distilled from the pricier Pixel 7, $599 and Pixel 7 Pro, $899. The 7a easily outshines many similarly priced competitors, including the Apple iPhone SE, $429. And although it costs $50 more than the Pixel 6a did, you simply won't find a better Android phone for less than $500, making the Pixel 7a our editor's choice winner for mid-range smartphones. Google gets a lot right with the Pixel 7a, starting with the design. At a glance, hardly anything sets the Pixel 7a apart from the Pixel 7 and 7 Pro, which is a good thing. The phone features Google's now well-known camera bar running across the top of the rear panel. It's a bold look and I generally like it, as it differs visually from most other phones on the market. The main difference between the 7a and the Pricer 7 and 7 Pro is that it trades a glass rear panel for polycarbonate. This is imperceptible to the eye, but you can tell when you hold the phone. Importantly, the shiny material doesn't attract dust and fingerprints. The mid-frame of the Pixel 7a is made from an alloy and some internal portions of the housing are made from recycled aluminum. You can snag the Pixel 7a in four colors, charcoal, coral, sea, or snow. Coral is an online exclusive option available only via the Google Store. I received the snow color for review, and while it's not as vibrant as coral or sea, it's still a sharp-looking device. Number 2. Samsung Galaxy S23 The Samsung Galaxy S23, starting at $799.99, is a compact phone that features most of the same high-end specs and performance of its stablemates, the medium-sized Galaxy 23 Plus, starting at $999.99, and the gargantuan Galaxy S23 Ultra, starting at $1,199.99. The S23 offers better battery life than its predecessor, along with the most power you can get in a small Android phone. Slower charging speeds and a lack of ultra-wideband support keep it from truly competing with its larger S23 siblings, but it's a welcome alternative to the small hand friendly Apple iPhone 14, $799, and Google Pixel 7, $599. The Galaxy S23 which measures 5.8 by 2.8 by 0.3 inches, HWD, and weighs 5.9 ounces, is noticeably smaller than the S23 Plus, 6.2 by 3.0 by 0.3 inches, 6.9 ounces, and the Pixel 7, 6.1 by 2.9 by 0.3 inches, 6.9 ounces, but is about the same size as the base iPhone 14, 5.8 by 2.8 by 0.3 inches, 6.07 ounces. The OnePlus 11 5G is larger and heavier, 6.4 by 2.9 by 0.3 inches, 7.2 ounces. Number 1. Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. Samsung's raised its prices for 2023 compared to the previous Fold 4 and matched the Pixel Fold's asking price directly. But Galaxy Z Fold 4 owners who dropped the best part of $2,000 on the Galaxy Z Fold 3 or Z Fold 4 shouldn't look at the Z Fold 5 and feel like they're missing any killer features, but that doesn't stop the new phone from being a powerhouse. But while the Z Fold 5 is very similar to the Z Fold 4, 
it's still one of the most fully featured folding phones out there, with its S Pen support and foldable optimized interface helping it shine, while it carries forward the competent camera system of its predecessor. Just a few months after the Google Pixel Fold laid down the gauntlet to challenge Samsung's domination of foldables, Samsung unveiled its 2023 line of folding phones, with its Galaxy Z Fold 5 leading the charge, alongside the Z Flip 5. There are plenty of exciting, cutting-edge big-screened foldable phones in China, the Honor Magic V2, Oppo Find N2, and Xiaomi Mix Fold 3, but Samsung's Galaxy Z Fold series hasn't had as much competition in the West. Recent Western releases like the Honor Magic Versus, Huawei Mate X3, and Google Pixel Fold, the only one of the three available in the US, indicate the tides are turning. But no phone has pushed Samsung off the top spot since it dropped the first Galaxy Fold in 2019. And that's despite the fact the Z Fold line hasn't historically had great cameras for the price. This is the top 6 best camera phones in 2024. Please make sure to subscribe our channel for these kind of information. Thanks for watching.